I'm having a really rough time. Like I said, I broke up with my boyfriend. Hi. What's going on? Honey. Well, it, it looked pretty good in the store. I... Hey, guys, I got this. Got this. Got this. Got this. Got this. Got this. Guys, this is actually really simple. <laughs> If water's involved, we're gonna have to ground the car. Guys, it's hot in here. I think I'll just take off all my clothes. What about if we were place pants? Okay, this place does look pretty good. <laughs> Hi, guys. I need some guinea pigs. I swear to God, Sheldon, one day I'm gonna get the hang of talking to you. Well, I finally convinced the restaurant to give me a bartending shift, so I need to practice mixing drinks. So, Leonard, how about it? <laughs> How about a grasshopper? I make a mean grass. Okay, good. Coming up. Sheldon, what are you gonna have? <laughs> so, Coke. And swim to Cuba. I'd like to try a uh, slippery nipple. <laughs> okay, you're cut off. One day I'm okay. For... Are you talking to me? Him? I think that's the grasshopper. Oh, see what happened. Uh, Raj, Penny, you say you can't talk to women, but you've been talking to me. I'm fine. Okay, now I just... Okay, if you're gonna drink on this date, just promise me you won't overdo it. Yeah, that. Uh, why don't you bring her to my restaurant while I'm tending the bar so I can keep an eye on you? Yes, what's up? <laughs> yeah? Okay. So, my friend, friends do not get their friends' care bears all sweaty. <laughs> Penny. Oh, that's so sweet. But I'm going out dancing with a girlfriend. Well, for Penny, it's dancing night. No. <laughs> All right, now, Sheldon, you and I are about to have a problem. <laughs> now you're supposed to say, wow, what an interesting fact. Come here, you crazy, nerdy guy. I could never be mad at you. Person on a double date that included Howard Wallowitz? <laughs> Thank you. Would you be willing to go to my psychic and see what it's all about? <laughs> I would not. Really? Saying I don't have an open mind? I know. I want to talk to you. We have no overlapping. Can you just let me in? Okay, here's the deal. We are going to throw Leonard a kick-ass surprise party. Just doesn't know he wants one because he's never had one. Howard, here's the difference. The possibility exists that Leonard could have a birthday party before hell freezes over. <laughs> Scars that no non-professional can heal. We are going to throw Leonard a birthday party. If I had your Manon bag, all of your most valuable mint condition comic won't know which. <laughs> Sheldon, do you understand the concept of blackmail? <laughs> That's my friend Carol. Remind me, I got to introduce her to Howard. <laughs> Looks like you've been to the Renaissance Fair. I'm hoping. <laughs> okay, fine, whatever. Um, you guys, this is my friend. <laughs> Yeah, it's good to see you, too. Oh. Oh, well, good for him. Yeah, but why are you sitting here? Why don't you just go to a movie or something? Yeah, why not? Well, then don't order popcorn. No. Well, why don't you go to a coffee shop? They have other things. I don't know, you know, cookies, pastries. Pastry. Okay, well, I have a date, too, so I'll see ya. Okay, well, good night. No, I still don't understand why you don't just go to dinner or something. Good night, Sheldon. Okay, where is this coming from? Your arch enemy. Yes. Oh, sweetie, I'm sorry. She called me dumbass. I know, I heard. Oh, gee, well, thank you for that. But um, I think for now, Leonard and I are just gonna stay friends. No, that response is unacceptable to me. <laughs> Sheldon, you are a smart guy. You I'm must smart? know. Smart? Are you gonna let me talk? I'm... You must know that if Leonard and Leslie want to be together, nothing you can do is going to stop it. You continue to underestimate my capabilities, madam. <laughs> okay, let me put it this way. If you're really Leonard's friend, you will support him no matter who he wants to be with. Wait a minute. <laughs> if Leonard... Because love trumps hate. <laughs> Thank you, Sheldon. Don't even start. They told me I look too Midwest for the part. Two Midwest, what the hell is that of yours now? And I haven't gotten a single acting job, gotten a raise at work, haven't even had sex in six months, and just now when I was walking up those stairs, a fly flew in my mouth and I ate it! <laughs> he said he'll get here when he gets here. I am frustrated because I am a failure at everything and my breath smells like fly! Yeah, okay. Uh, listen, I need to talk to Sheldon. 
Don't patronize me. Just get the sword. There you go. One enchanted sword. All right, give me, give me, give me. Sheldon. No danger. Look, it's just me, Penny. Listen, I got to level 25 and reached Purple Lotus Swamp, right? Leonard gave me an emergency. Well, can we go talk in the living room? Well, wear different pajamas. Okay, fine. Just tell me, is it too soon to join a quest to the Black Castle? Yeah, yeah, by some guys in Budapest. I'm just not sure it's the right move for my character. <laughs> well, 25. Really? Boy, you'd think you could trust a horde of Hungarian barbarians. <laughs> oh, hey, Leonard, listen, don't go in Sheldon's room. He's not walking right. in front of me without being drunk. <sighs> by myself. I'm better off alone, so... Goodbye, you poor, strange little man. Sheldon! What is it? Thanks for the update. Yeah, I, I really don't think I do. I mean, you'll be fine as long as you don't do that bungee cord thing, okay? <laughs> yes, Sheldon, we are friends. <laughs> oh, dear God. When you're done, we'll go.